Good morning. I am getting ready to just have a regular day of running around and doing stuff. But um, it's first thing in the morning. Sorry about all this. Um, and I wanted to say that I am reading my newspaper, drinking my coffee. Here's the newspaper. Here's the coffee. And then I was gone, I've gone through, sorry, gone through some cards that I've received in my um, P.O. box. I'm very excited about. If you are the owner of this lovely, lovely card, there is no return address and I can't send you a card back. So, and if you win in the drawing, I won't know where to send it or anything like that either. So, and I'm, the name is, I'm not sure what the name is, so I can't even say that. It, I, it sounds like a beautiful name. It ends in S-I, looks like. So anyway, if you're that owner, let me know um, so that I can make sure I've got all that information. You can email me your address um, so that it's safe. So anyway, there's that. Um, today I... I am working um, at the food bank. I volunteer there three hours, so I'll be working there for three hours today. And then after that, I'm going to be driving down um, to pick up a gift card for someone that I need to grab a gift card for. And just things like that. I have some presents to wrap, a little bit, a few. And then um, I need to make cookies. I have not made cookies yet at all. So, <laughs> soon after my coffee and newspaper, I'm gonna jump in the shower, get ready, work at the food bank, and you're coming with me. <laughs> Yay. We're on our way to the food bank. Um, I go every week and I volunteer three hours there on the reception desk. So basically it, um, I made a video about it a long time ago when I was first starting out on YouTube. So it was, many of you probably have never seen that. Um, but so you don't even know that I do this. But anyway, yeah, every week I work at the food bank and um, try to help out the best I can. So that's where I'm headed today. And this is our craziest, busiest time of year, so uh, yeah, it's it's nuts there. And I know that they can really use the help. So um, that's where we're headed now. And here I am pulling into the uh, Northern Illinois Food Bank, and it services um, pretty much the large portion of the northern, northeastern side of the state. Um, of Illinois. So anyway, it's a huge operation. If you haven't seen my other video, I think about six people have um, about it and I was just starting so I didn't say much. But anyway, it's a fabulous operation. Basically different corporations and grocery stores and so forth truck their food in here and it goes through conveyor belts and a whole bunch of volunteers and everybody um, basically just works really hard to make sure that we have Christmas baskets out for needy families and um, you know all that good stuff so basically the trucks then take the food that has been donated by people and corporations and grocery stores and so forth and the trucks come get the food and take it out to the pantries and then the pantries is where the people get the food from the ones that need the food so people don't come here to get food they usually just they, for here it's you give the food for us to get out to the people who get get the food so <laughs> anyway so I field calls for three hours a week and help do paperwork and help uh, organize the volunteers and so forth and do things and help them get where they need to go. And that's what I do. So anyway, um, I'm glad you could see this with me. Mm, Northern Illinois Food Bank feeding our hungry neighbors. So let's go check the place out and see what it's like in there today. It might be crazy. It might be a lull time between volunteers. One o'clock is when a whole bunch more volunteers come through. And I work behind this desk. I am stuffing. There's like 3,000 thank you letters that we have to stuff and seal. So I'm working on that in this big empty conference room today. So I'm doing that and then I also just completed a bunch of credit card slip things that to uh, make sure all the information is correct in the computer. So that's what I'm doing. <laughs>
We're getting there. Okay, driving away now, heading to the Sears hardware store. Sears whatever, appliance and hardware, I don't remember. Anyway, I'm going to pick up a Sears gift card. Um, that's one more gift I need to get. And then I'm going to head home and hopefully start baking some cookies. Not sure. We'll see. So I got the gift card for Sears and I've wrapped it all interestingly in that. And now I'm quickly trying to make a batch of peppernuts or peppernuts. So it's a German Christmas cookie that my family has made a hundred times if not more, all through my life. And I've got everything all set out and ready. And I'm gonna get the dough um, in, you know, totally ready and then gonna chill it. And then probably tomorrow, I'm gonna roll it into balls and bake them into cookies. So that's what's happening now. So I finished the dough and it is, um, I'll show you what it does. So you have to put it in the fridge. So basically, it goes in a bowl like this, uh, well, whatever kind of bowl, and you just let it sit overnight and the flavors all meld together. And then you roll it into like walnut-sized balls and you bake them and they end up looking like rocks, but they're really, really tasty and it's been a recipe, it's a recipe that's been in our family for a very long time. So anyway, that's a must for us for Christmas. Now I'm gonna make some chicken and throw it on a salad. Okay, I'll show you. The finished Christmas tree I never did really show. So anyway, this is what it looks like. Simple, but we think it's very pretty. We like it and as my kids say, Santa already came. I pretty much am finished with the presents. That's gonna be it. And uh, that's gonna be fun. And then the hallway here, we have lights and stuff going up the steps, which I always like that at Christmas time. So anyway. We have more decorations here and there and all over the place, but this is the main bit. And um, tomorrow I will be um, going with my daughter who just graduated. We're getting a massage um, at noon. And then after that, a couple hours later, I get to have a root canal, a Christmas root canal. <laughs> that's what I've been calling it. So anyway, that's not gonna be fun, but it's something I have realized I actually have to have and it's starting to really bother me. So I guess it's a good thing. I hope that I can just recover from it fast and still enjoy Christmas and all that. So that's happening tomorrow. I don't think I'll be vlogging anything tomorrow because of that I can't really vlog the massage and I'm not gonna vlog the root canal. So anyway, saying good night for now and I will talk to you again soon. Bye guys.